will never learn anything by being told. They have to find out for themselves. Hallu, hallu. Hello, fellow citizens of Livonia. My name is Laura Toy, and I am your current Livonia City Council President, and I'm running for re-election. I've spent years as your president since 1988. My father was part of the police force since the 1950s. So I can honestly say that I have the years of experience and a deep-rooted connection with Livonia that's perfect for this position. I love the city, the community that it brings, the education programs, the programs that it has for its citizens, and the safety that it has. Though I adore our city, I know there are some underlying issues. Education is very important, and Livonia does it very well. I spent years as a chairperson at the School District Liaison Committee up until 1993. I also spent time as the vice chairperson for the Committee of Public Safety, Education, and Recreation. Livonia School Districts are known for the 91% graduation rate, excellent academics, AP program, sports, and an outstanding teaching staff. But there's an underlying problem. Something a lot of people don't want to talk about. Some of our students in the Lone School District are suffering from a drug abuse problem. It's hard to talk about, but it is very detrimental and needs to be dealt with. To solve this problem, I, as City Council President, will team up with Livonia Save Our Youth. The Livonia Save Our Youth Group is a volunteer group that focuses on keeping our schools safe and drug free. They educate the students about the negative effects of drugs and stop the spread of drugs through certain programs and volunteer services. They go to schools and make sure that they are clean and drug free and try to educate students so they will not try these drugs. It's happening inside and outside our school, and it needs to stop. Our youth is the future of this city, and I want to do whatever it takes to keep them safe, healthy, and protected. Another thing I want to focus on is the safety of our borders. On May 28th of 2013, there was a shooting on St. Francis Street in 1900 block in Livonia, Michigan. 24-year-old camp man waiting for his friend was shot by 21-year-old Gregory Eli. The assailant came up to the car and frightened the victim who drove away. As the victim was driving away, the assailant shot at him. This should not happen in any part of Livonia and is unacceptable. Though the area was located near Redford or in Southfield, there is no excuse. To solve the problem, I will put in more police patrol in areas that are around other cities. Livonia is only very safe, but it seems that around our borders, more and more crime is happening, including drug problems. I want to make sure that nothing in Livonia is unsafe. Of course, with education and public safety, I will keep our financial um, stability maintained. We were able to maintain it to the financial crisis through the years that I was running for president and president, and I will keep with that. As well as our program, we have very excellent programs for our citizens, and I want to make sure that they are still there and still working properly. I love our city. It has a great community, great education program, and safe. And I want to keep it that way. Times go on, things change. But I want to make sure Livonia is known for its safety and education and community. If we're elected, I will make sure that Livonia is a community that we all love and keep it the way it has been through the years and years. Thank you, and I hope to see you at the polls.